But two more candidates who've gotten more attention as the campaign has raged on have been Sandy Kennedy and Zach Bonahum. We head back out to Republican election headquarters now, and that is where we find News Channel 15's Elizabeth Fields. She will be keeping an eye on an interesting city clerk's race for us tonight. That's right, Mark. There are a couple of interesting dynamics about this race. First, Zach Bonahum is attempting to get into his first public office. Democrat Sandy Kennedy has been in office for a long time. In fact, she's been city clerk for 28 years. And that leads us to the second interesting dynamic. Sandy Kennedy has been in office longer than Zach Bonahum has even been alive. He's only 22 years old. And in fact, that age difference has kind of been playing more of a role than uh, the party affiliations have. One more thing, on one, more than one occasion, uh, Zach Bonahum has made headlines because of uh, some of his Twitter comments that he's made. One was about Fort Wayne Community School Board member Mark Giaquinta, and the other was a reference to officers patrolling parking being Nazis. He also had a run in with his neighborhood association regarding campaign signs. Sandy Kennedy, on the other hand, has run a pretty quiet campaign, but some argue that that's kind of the problem. She's comfortable in her role and her position. We're going to be here all night as the numbers roll in to see whether Bonahum will be able to oust Kennedy from her office.